I only got an hour. Oh, I gotta go leave to take my car in. <clears throat> And my alarm's gonna go off soon. I need to grab my phone in a bit. It's charging. I might need it fucking all day. I should probably bring headphones too. I'm gonna do that. I'll be right back. I'm gonna actually grab some stuff. morning hello hello uh i mean it might be a good day we'll see i got, I got i'm going in like an hour A good day is I go there and it's cheap and quick. A bad day is... Oh, the opposite. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know what's wrong with it yet. <clears throat> it's loud. Breaking noises. I'm just hoping something's loose or some small thing's broken. We'll see though. I'm gonna wait there like an hour. Probably tell them, you know, <laughs> let me know how long it's gonna take if they find out. Cause I don't want to be sitting there all day. I'll just get a shuttle from them. But I don't also want to like leave after, you know, when it's gonna be done in like 30 minutes. So. I'm going to wait like an hour. We'll see. I'm going to pay enough, so... I'm sure they can give me a shuttle. Today at 3, we got a... Like a Sony... Sony conference. I think that'll be like 40 minutes. Yeah, I mean, I went, uh, just for a checkup and oil change, and I was there for, like, an hour or two, so. I'm, I'm almost considering just getting a shuttle right away. Like, there's a very small chance it'll be a quick fix. <clears throat> I'd almost rather just go for it. Like, what worst case, I could have picked my car up after an hour or something. I'll just pick it up tomorrow. I don't know why I'm here. I guess I wanted to explore. Yeah, we'll see. My car is not 
cheap to do repairs on it seems. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I mean, like, I'd be willing to wait like two hours because I just browse on my phone, but man, it's unlikely it'll be two hours. Because I'm going at 10, so they've already got cars in there. Can I not get past any of this? Weird, there's so many spots that look like you could get to, but I'll just ask them to do that then, I think. Why not? I don't care if I put them out. I'm paying for it, so. Oh, two people -y? Yeah. Well, they got their little waiting room with their coffee and some donuts or some shit. I just got shit I'd rather do. I'd rather come back and try to get fucking Uru done. I was gonna do some other game in between this and Tales of Arise and shit, but I don't know if I'm gonna have time at this point. <laughs> Hers taking a lot longer than I thought. Anything's better than sitting there at a fucking car dealership, though. <clears throat> thing is I just took it in a few months ago so I either just didn't catch it or it's a very new problem oh cool well thanks for hanging yeah we made some good progress on uh, one of the worlds finished that up it was really good I actually thought it was probably the best world and it probably will stay the best world in this I I put it up there with some of the better shit in the rest of the series but sadly uh not feeling the same about the other ones it took forever that shit took forever but it was good I just always feel like there should be something here. It's like bizarre to me that there's just nothing. Like I'm just missing something. Part of me just wants to like pretend this expansion doesn't exist and that it's just for lore, but I know you can finish it. <laughs> I, I know you can. But I should probably finish up the uh, the main story. Is this interlink a lot? Could be why I can't find anything to do. But there's a, like another area or something. Yeah. Mm. I'm still having enough fun. That's just taking longer than I thought. Maybe later today, if I still haven't solved anything, I'll take a hint on the pyramid puzzle but we'll see I just wanted to get a little in today or this morning an hour or I missed my car appointment as much as I'd rather Imagine my car has no issues. You doing any persona today? Let me know if you have any effects. <laughs> I 
the Rona. I'm not seeing anything up here. That's my deal with this zone, is I just, I don't even know, not even anything to fiddle with, other than the lights in that one area. Which isn't very fun to fiddle with. They'll announce anything big at the Sony thing tonight. I mean, it's probably about time for Sony to actually announce some games for the PS5. I'm probably expecting, like, maybe a few things. We'll see. I don't know how you add more to this. Gotta be away. Um, I mean, right, the new Ratchet and Clank. Um, there's a few console exclusives they have. A lot of their stuff that seems exclusive is still releasing on the PS4. Like Spider-Man, Miles Morales and shit. Um, Horizon Forbidden West will be exclusive. Not out yet. What else is exclusive, man? Let me look it up, actually. I'm curious. They don't have much. There's that new one with the... That looks like a Pixar movie. Kenna. Yeah, there's not much. There's a reason, as somebody who plays a lot of games, I still haven't bought a PS5. Like, there's not a whole lot. I mean, God of War will be when that comes out. Like, there's some things that'll come out that will be for sure, but... More spoken... I mean, Demon Souls remake, I guess. That's kind of a big one. Yeah, I think they're still difficult to get, which is another thing. Is one, I don't have much reason to buy one. There's not many games. Two, they're fucking expensive. And three, they're hard to get, so I'd rather just wait until, like, a price cut. I don't know what they could announce that I would, like, get one. Fucking Bloodborne 2, man. Because I'll get one eventually, but... The Last of Us part. Aren't they remaking The Last of Us 1 first? I thought Naughty Dog was just full on on the remake thing now. Maybe not. I feel like we'd see another Uncharted. Uncharted gets really stale, though.
I think almost all of these are closed off. There's not a whole lot of point in getting an Xbox, <clears throat> a Series X, unless you just, like, need a next-gen console. Most of that shit comes out on PC. <clears throat> I probably won't get one of those this gen, unless they make, like, legitimate exclusives. And this place, my favorite place. Whew. I'm already on and just looking at it. I have to listen to music in here. So we're not even moving. Yeah, this puzzle is super arcane, man. <clears throat> I don't know if this has to do with it or what.
I'm just going to look at these before uh, I have to leave. Not like I can work on them, though, when I'm there. A little too much going on still. I mean, this is like a combination of a bunch of shit. Well, if it matters, though. Take a pic for fun. Name on both sides. I should take a picture of these. Oh, shit. The trailer's out? Oof. Uh, maybe I'll watch that at the fucking car dealership. Or the, I mean, it's a dealership service combo place. But... <sighs> I'm not expecting anything out of that. I've read some of the script ideas and shit. It seems fucking funky, but we'll see. Resurrections. One new book. What is the new book? Was it just this one? That would be a great place to start. <laughs> like, if there was a singular book that you start the expansion on, then that would, like, narrow things down. But they kind of, you kind of get, like, a bunch of these just from, like, the normal game. That's a bit weird. I feel like this would be the new book, the second one. Imply I can do something here? Did I miss something? Don't let me know how the trailer is. I mean, I'll watch it myself, I guess, too, but... Have the Wachowskis done, like, anything? Since like V for Vendetta. 
I feel like it's gonna be it's just trying to there's one of those where they resurrect a series because they got nothing else. <laughs> Isn't it, it's got Keanu in that the chick, right? The Trinity girl. At least I saw like a on set screenshot of them. It's not a screenshot, but you know. Oh, really? Only one of them? Huh. No, I could believe it. Makes me wonder even more how it's going to be. Please avoid drinking the lake water. Okay. I mean, this is a thing. I don't remember how to translate this shit. I mean, obviously it's been forever. Since I've messed with any of the Tony languages. Yeah, I feel like there's no way, man. Like, no way. Yeah, I feel like it's going to be either trying to jump the shark or... Just being this, like, out-of-date, weird... fucking thing of them trying to kind of relive a past glory. Or some modernized abomination. I don't know. Not sure. People already have enough issues with the originals. Yeah, I agree for the most part. They're fun enough, uh... Hollywood sideshow, but the first one's, yeah, definitely the best. I haven't seen them in a long time, so we'll rewatch them again in the Discord at some point. I don't remember hating two and three, but it was definitely more of just the Hollywood action thing. Didn't have a lot of the ideas, but it's been a long time, so. Yeah, it reminds me of the uh, the KFC guy. And was that in Reloaded? No, I agree with you, Aquilina. I mean, not up to par. And I don't see how one they're going to make like 15 plus years later is going to be even comparable. I feel like it's going to be like an Evangelion thing, where the reboots have lost the complete soul and idea of the whole thing in favor of glitz and glamour in Hollywood. Yeah, non-stop CGI. What happened to practical effects, man? Like the modern Marvel movies, man, if you ever just like get a still of those, they look like shit compared to like some of the older Amy ones that use practical shit. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's CG in the Raimi ones that suck, but it's fucking weird, man. I mean, I guess it's just easier to have, like, an entire team who just does all the CG and all the effects instead of, like, hiring somebody that does, like, costumes and practical stuff. I 
Like, Black Panther CG fucking suck, man. I still can't believe that movie is as highly rated as it is. It was so nothing. <laughs> that fucking CGI was bad. All about the money, probably. Streamlining it. They've probably got quite the template for making movies nowadays. I mean, the story was alright. It was a little cheesy sometimes. I thought the villain was a little corny, but that might have been the acting. I don't know. Cape shit movies for me, like... I'm just kind of getting tired of them. I still, like, see most of them. Although, since COVID, I haven't kept up. I think I watched a few episodes of WandaVision. That was it. But it really is just, like, popcorn flicks. I kind of wish they weren't as popular as they were, so that other things could take the limelight. We could see a bit more creativity and not just cape shit movies. I was like, I'm fine with them existing. It's just like, I feel like that's a lot of all there is sometimes. Studios trying to make big, like, universes and shit just to kind of, like, get in on the cape shit fucking pie. Yeah, after Endgame, I mean, I watched the Spider-Man one. I think that was what was after it. That one was like, okay. Even Hall couldn't really super save it. And I just haven't gotten into the shows. I didn't hear good things about Captain America and the Winter Soldier. And that's crazy considering... I feel like the level of uh, blindfold a lot of fans have on. Free Guy? Was that the one with uh, Ryan Reynolds? I've heard that one was decent. Maybe. I haven't seen it. Yeah, Reynolds is cool. When he actually gets to do stuff off the... Like Deadpool and stuff, it's pretty neat. Maybe I'll watch it at some point. I want to see Dune. I hope Dune is like, like really awesome. And then we start having more crazy movies. <laughs> Just more adaptations of old books, like Lord of the Rings, man. I'll take it. I would take another. I want another like Lord of the Rings esque, like quality trilogy. There's not enough time in your life to go watch them all. There's a lot of them now, too. Yeah, I've fallen so behind. And my thing is, like, when I'm at home, dude, and I'm like, you know, okay, I'm going to pick a TV show to watch or I'm going to pick a movie, like, there's a lot of choices, right? Like, going to see something in a theater kind of has, like, some spectacle to it. But other than just wanting to be a completionist and keep up with the Marvel stuff, I would much rather watch any anime, go watch, like, I need to go watch Dark, finally. Any movie, like we're working our bonds, right? Like, I mean, there's just so much else. And I'm sure there's some good Marvel TV shows, but I don't. I just, I don't know. I fell behind on it, and I have not had the, the lust to continue. I have not seen The Green Knight. I think the last movie I saw in theaters was the Godzilla one. I like going to the theaters. I mean, I'll see art house shit, I'll see big shit. But yeah, really. I need to see what's good right now. I'm so used to not going because of COVID, I haven't been keeping track. I wanted to see that Nicolas Cage one with the, the big. I think it's just called Big. But it wasn't in theaters. That I could find to do it on Discord at some point. Yeah, I think Dune's in October, so hopefully that's cool. Yeah, it wasn't bad when I watched Godzilla. It was pretty, pretty light. And I mean, I always go at weird times, anyways, with my brother, so. I think he's going this weekend to see something with somebody.
We solved the pyramid. Not yet. I'm just running around like a madman. I gotta leave in like 10, 20 minutes. I'm looking through this area, seeing if I missed some kind of something. I've not really dabbled in this puzzle. No, I haven't even looked at that today. I'm looking at, uh, this is the first expansion's content. It's kind of weird how it's piecemealed to you. And I'm not even sure if it's possible for me to do anything right now. I might have to finish the story. I'm just trying to find some kind of, like, like, some, some goal in this place. The last Paul Walker Fast and the Furious movie? I haven't seen a Fast movie since fucking... Well, since before they started calling it the Fast series. I think it was like... Three was the last one I saw. Tokyo Drift. Yeah, I don't know. When I'm at home, the last thing on my mind is watching a Marvel movie. I'll do it, like, if I'm, like, in a prep for a new one. Like, I think I watched the first, the second Thor at home so I could get ready for Ragnarok or something. And, like, that was about, that's about the only time I'll do it. I mean, I liked the first few. But, I mean, I was really young, so it was probably just like, haha, cars and Vin Diesel punching people. <laughs> I don't know if they hold up. If Ludacris is still, still got it. Is Ludacris still in fucking the Fast movies? Or they phase him out. He's probably, he probably died in one of the movies or something. Vin Diesel's best role is Groot. I'm more of a Riddick guy myself. I wish he would do Riddick 4. I think he's been trying to, but... Riddick's not big enough, man. I like me some Riddick. But Groot's good, too. His best role's gonna be Ark Survival Evolve 2. It's gonna be in that. I don't know what he plays in it. Some caveman. <laughs> it looks so fucking just bizarre, man, seeing him in this, like, weird CG. Like super uncanny volume. I don't see anything going on here. Oh wait, there's something here. What's this? What is this? Red, green, blue? Is this micro fucking little hidden spot actually telling me something? Well, the question is, do I do red, green, blue in that order, or do I just do... Or do I have to pick one at a time? Yeah, cool. I haven't played Ark yet. I know it's very grindy. About it.
Hopefully, I mean, the second one's an improvement. And yeah, no reason to think it's not other than maybe being a little weird about them focusing in on Hollywood actors. Buggy? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just sure it takes a very long time to finish stuff. This is four here. Defaults are pretty fucked. Mm. I feel like some of the eggs and shit are pretty crazy. My phone is probably about to ring. No, I don't blame you. I wouldn't. Nobody should have that kind of time for a dino. Just playing like an MMO, and like that's the whole fucking thing. I don't think there was something like this in the other zone. Oh, is there microtransactions for time? Or does it just have the gameplay of one? That's so weird. <laughs> I make your game day sound like gotcha micro type of shit. Hmm. Yeah, well, I mean, I'm sure if you fix the rates yourself, yeah, I mean, that seems like the way to do it. Hmm. My phone's a battery, I'll be back. I uh, probably have like 10 minutes. I'm going to leave.
Well, other than discovering this, I've not found much. I don't think there's another one of these somewhere either, is the thing. Maybe? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna go there and request a shuttle right away. No way it'll be done in like an hour. I don't see anything magically opening when I mess with the light. I didn't know there's a lot of griefing in Ark, so I'm not surprised. I'm not finding much, man. I don't know what exactly this is supposed to do. Oh, okay. Hmm. I don't really know what's supposed to be happening here. There ain't much. Well, at least we found a little something. I guess. I could get there a little early. I mean, what are they going to do? Stop me? No, you can't come here. You're 20 minutes early. Shit out of my way, man. Alright. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and stop here. I will catch you guys. I guess when I get back. So, 3 p.m. CST today is the Sony press conference. Or we'll see. Hopefully, something of value, but probably a lot of that kind of game. Probably some Horizon shit. Maybe we'll see the new God of War, I'm not sure. I'm not expecting anything too exciting, but 
we'll see. Catch you guys in a bit.